Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to what is the opening day of the 16th European Championships. 55 UEFA member states tried their hand at becoming the finest of them all. Now we are left with the 24 who have made it to these finals. Opening day certainly has a special feel to it. The atmosphere combustible but joyous as we usher in a new era for this competition together with the hopes and aspirations of all that take part. Worth reminding ourselves too that 2020 is the 60th birthday of these championships and it is for that special reason that the competition is being held right across the continent. This stadium has that feel of a genuine Colosseum. It could only be Rome. Here it is then, the first page of the first chapter of this special tournament. All I hope is that these nations, as well as the players of course, can make a good account of themselves. And I also like the fact that such excitement isn't just something that one host country has a monopoly of. It's shared by so many people across the continent, literally, and that certainly created a, an extra special buzz. And it's Pablo Sarabia. Receives it in a good position. He's had a big chance! Just off target. I don't need to tell you he got underneath it, and there's only one place it can go. Spain are enjoying the lion's share of possession, but nothing yet to show for it. And here's Morata, has a goal! Goal, Spain! Spain are so well practiced in the art of keeping the ball through wonderful passive movement and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. Llorente, and it's Koke. Goes for goal! That's a half-decent try. Koke clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. Oh, let down by a lack of accuracy. Certainly tested the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Morata. Koke. Pablo Sa shoots. Oh, high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Has a pop! In he 
you're alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Now look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Morata has a hit! And that would have been game, set and match. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he'll be desperate to get another. <laughs> well, there's going to be another change here. Well, with the introduction of such a tall lad now, we may well see uh, a more predictable, lofty route forward, but it's still very hard to deal with that, you know, if they, if they can affect it right. Deftly done. Nice little flick. And the finish! Sticks it away! Spain are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's the clever use of counter attacking. That's the real highlight. Brings it to a close. Oh, that's the way to launch the campaign. Oh, they can look ahead with confidence and comfort. So what do you take away from it all, Jim?